setting up a gag, delivering the gag, and uh, the timing of, of how it works. And, you know, it could be a, a few frames or a couple seconds off, and it's, that's the difference between funny and not funny. It could be timing, which we talked about. Acting. Uh, because if you have a really great comic actor, you really don't have to do that much to them. Uh, on Alan McBeal, I came in and I tried to put all these different cuts and reactions because I thought they were funny, and they said, no, just let Callista do her thing sometimes. We could just like hang on her and let her be funny. And so that makes your life much easier and has nothing to do with your editing. It just has to do with, you know, having great material. And at least in most of the stuff that I edit, uh, heart would be the third thing. Actually, I think that... Uh putting these things in front of an audience is really important because sometimes you may think something isn't funny and an audience, general audience, could think differently. But I think that um, when you're in dailies and, and the first funny scene comes up and the actor or the scene just isn't funny, um, you sort of have a responsibility to say to the director, hey, this is not funny. And uh, sometimes by additional coverage or by um, the director honing in on that, although usually they know that there's a problem. Sometimes they don't like to talk about it. You can improve the performance as the film is being shot. Things happen when they're shooting, and sometimes people have fallen in love with a scene that they shot on set, and they thought it was totally hilarious, and it was the most hilarious thing ever, and you know, the, their favorite lighting guy was there cracking up, and, and they've kind of fallen in love with it, and then they bring it into the cutting room, and you're somebody that actually wasn't on set, or, or when you put it up in an audience, they weren't there on set, and they didn't, and then you can actually see if it really works. For me, as a, as a person who does, we were talking about romantic comedy, but you know, comedy that kind of comes out of reality, to me, life is funny all the time, and so no matter how serious it gets, those moments are the moments that kind of draw people in. 